Here we go. Same piece from the beginning. Always when you first move, you're kind of afraid that you won't make friends. And I really didn't want to move, and I was freaking out. Like, Fine. my sister, when we were moving, she went on a fast and locked herself in a closet, which, by the way, lasted 10 minutes, because then she got hungry and wanted a snack. I got to the American school, and by the third day, I had made, like, five really good friends. Last year, I made tons of friends on Outward Bound in your advisory, because you're always working together. You sleep in the same room for, like, four nights. I loved canyoning. At first, I was really scared to jump off the rocks. I'm like, oh my gosh, what if I hit my head or something? But after that first jump, oh my gosh, I just wanted to keep going. I mean, some, some of it is hard work and you're team building and you're helping each other around and it's, it's not always easy, but it is by far like the best thing I've ever done. We went in the Lake District in Northern England and we jogged around and then we jumped in the lake and it was freezing. It was really, really hot, right? And it was would, like freezing. almost get cardiac arrest. And but it was, we do it again. But it was so much fun. But beginning on Thursday, two people every single day will be responsible for bringing in news events to share with the class. Palestinian Authority President Mahmoud Abbas on Sunday ordered 13,000 security forces to deploy near the border to the forces. This blue area, right about here, this is where Israel is. Oh. I have one favorite subject, and it would definitely be English, because I really like to write stories. Okay, so you've got space in the middle here. The meat and potatoes really all needs to go here. I'm absolutely terrible at math. Math is actually like my second favorite class. It's one of the three subjects that come like really easily to me. I don't know why, I just... I get it, and I know that some people like it's really frustrating for, but I actually like math. If you divide an hour by three, you get 20 minutes, and then you divide 30 miles per hour by three, you get um, 10 miles. Mm, I don't get math concepts, because for me, it's social studies and English. Right, that's pretty good. Well, How fun. many sources do you have? So me and my friend Emily made a rockumentary, and it's like a PowerPoint presentation about sedimentary, igneous, and metamorphic rocks. If they get hit by erosion, becomes sedimentary rock. I decided to do the Scottish accent. Hi, I'm Dr. Rocky. I've been working on this documentary for 30 years. I can't stop. Something like that. Anyway, so then I had to be a igneous rock. And so I'd like put on the squeaky voice for some reason, which I'm not going to do because it like is terrible. No, 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 it's not as bad as the metamorphic rock, actually. The metamorphic rock is like this weird lady. Anyway, this is a good example of what we expected, right? So, yeah. For me, one of the things I like is the extracurricular activities. I think of this school are really great. There's soccer in the fall, there's soccer in the winter, there's soccer in the spring. I play the flute in band. I like to sing. I'm in choir and I horseback ride. Me and Austin are the head of the Model United Nations Club. Another one. Come on. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And um, you can do MUN, you can do Knowledge Bowl. All those in favor? Against? I can't wait to go to Mexico because it's going to be really fun. We go to Monterey. It's the biggest um, it's the most MUN conference for middle school. Stop rolling, stop flipping, stop doing anything except thinking. Last Any year? Questions? Me and my friends developed this cult of Miss Forish, and we'd like come into class and be like, Miss Forish! Miss Forish! And we'd go crazy over Miss Forish. My cat and Miss Forish's cat are the best cats. Well, Miss Forish's cat is, Ms. Fer is Mr. Forish. Yes, Fer but she cat. calls him Butch. And Miss Forish, if she calls him Butch, it's Butch. Not Butchy, it's, it's Butch. No, Miss Forish says Butch, so it's, it's Butch. Butchy. Simple. Although my cat definitely. Maybe it's a nickname. It's way out there because she doesn't do anything unless somebody gets in the room and then she'll like, she'll be sleeping and then somebody will sit down, she'll wake up. She'll